Hello, welcome to Crowded Lab channel. Today I will do auto draft review. This is AI image generator that recently became available on AppSumo. It got several good reviews already, and they specialize on several models to produce semi realistic anime and comic images. And in my opinion, it is a good thing that they specialize on several things. So there are high chances that they will execute those well. And as any AI image generator, they provide additional features. Besides to text to image, they have image to image, AI image in painting, object remover, background remover, upscaler. One interesting thing is that they provide pose maker where you can define a pose for your character. Also, besides normal upscale, they provide creative upscale. So they will enhance your image while upscaling it. And for all plans, you get the same amount of features, except for the third plan you can train your own custom model that could be useful to get consistent characters. They have some examples of consistent characters, which you can put in different scenes. And other differences are just in amount of credits per month that you can use for your image generation. Let's also take a look at the regular pricing for auto draft. They provide several plans. For example, for $30 monthly, you will be able to get 400 generations per month. This is a uh, half of the generations compared to their first tier plan on apps. Okay, let's jump into the testing. Here is their main dashboard. Out of the box, you can see they provide realistic anime and comic models. Realistic, I believe it is a semi-realistic. Let's test it. Let it be a new project. Let it be so. After creating a project, we can see the dashboard. We can see that this project is for realistic model. Let's generate some images. Let's use this prompt. Real estate agent in a business suit standing in front of a house with a garage. We can choose the aspect ratio. Here we can see that they have some characters pre-trained. We don't need those for now. Consistent styles, let's use none. Let's use 4K and hyper-realistic. Advanced options, let's leave all to the default state. Let's generate. The tool will generate four images and this goes in one generation and it will burn one credit. Okay, we got four images. I would say we cannot directly use those on a website. Maybe this one, if we will update the car. Let's edit the image with AI paint. Okay. Let's put white CV in place of white space. Okay, we got some results. I think this one is better and it's more usable than other images. Let's do another test. Okay, these are the results. If we call this model semi-realistic, I think it will be fair and uh, some images with Beto upgrading can be used. These are the results for this prompt. You can see for yourself and see if you like the output. Let's do a test with the predefined models. For that, you need to copy the name. Let's generate. And here it is. So with defined models, you will be able to get same character. However, they have only three models trained at the moment. And with Lysis tier 3 on Absomo, 
you should be able to generate your own though I cannot say how consistent they will be now let's test another model let it be anime okay these are our results let's actually do creative upscaling okay it changed the scene however now it's not a rabbit it's a man in a rabbit mask okay let's test comic model like with any AI generation tool you need to be good at defining your prompts let's copy a prompt from lexica let's use this one and let's try this in auto draft yep and i think the results are very good so you can get inspiration for let's say your comic book and now let's actually do pose maker that's actually a nice feature let it be so let's copy the pose and use this prompt let's generate okay so we got our results based on our prompt and we defined the pose we've got our character and the pose is similar especially in this one quickly going through other features so the main feature is text to image they have image to image and actually when you define a pose they use image to image to help define the pose in the resulted image they have ai paint let's use an image i generated previously let's try replace the head let's generate okay here are the results of replacing part of the image so additionally the head pose maker that we checked and as any ai generation tool they have object remover upscaler background remover and they have something for product photography as well all right moving to the conclusion so the good thing is that the creators of AutoDraft AI image generator they focus on several models semi-realistic anime and comic if you will need realistic people probably it's not the best tool the tool had difficulties generating some faces in prompts that i tried i think it will be better for anime and comic styles especially if you will copy some prompts that are working already like you can copy some good prompts from lexica art and try to use those here additional features like ai in painting or image to image those will work similar to other ai image generators somewhat unique feature is pose maker where you can define in which pose you will need to have your character additional unique feature is ability to generate custom model however it will be only available if you will choose plan number three i think in the niche of ai image generator it will come to your personal preferences if you will like the tool or not if you will like the output or not and of course you will need to be good at defining exactly what you need out of the tool if you think this tool can be a great addition to your tool set please check the link in the description or scan qr code that you can see right now please also give this video a like and subscribe for more similar videos thank you for watching see you in the next one